Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. And all that is within me, bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. And forget not all His benefits. Amen. He forgives all my iniquities. And He heals all of my diseases. Praise God. He redeems my life from destruction. Hallelujah. This is how we fight our battles. It may look foolish to the world. It may look weak and crazy to the world, but I'm telling you, this is a backwards kingdom. Right. Amen. you got to go low to go high. Praise God. The Bible says, humble yourselves, then He will exalt you. Yeah. Praise God. Put others first. Right. Amen. And then you'll, you'll, you'll go to the front. Praise God. If you'll give, don't make any sense. The world tells you everybody needs to save. Amen. But the Bible says if you give, it will be given unto you. Right. Press down. Shake it together. Run it over. Praise God. Hallelujah. What a gift. What a God. What a mighty God we serve. He's awesome today. Praise God. Don't you love Him? Praise the Lord. Praise God. So good to see you here today in the house of the Lord. Amen. Turn to your neighbor. Look at him and say, My goodness, you look good today. Praise God. Everybody look, looking good. The sun's shining today. Man, God's given us. This is the day that the Lord has made. And I will, I've done made up my mind. I will rejoice. I will be glad in it. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And then we've got some exciting things. It's good to have the soul of an East band here with us today. And we people They're going to be blessing us here in just a few minutes with their talents and, and guess what? We're thankful that you're here today. Thank you for being here. And we're excited amen, to have you here today. How many Sullivan graduates we have in here in the house today? Amen. Proud. Loud and proud. Is that all the representation we have here at this church? And bluffs to hit you back there. That counts too. Bluffs to hit you, man. Amen. For you old guys, bluffs to hit you. That's the same thing. Amen. It's kind of nice on that. Praise. We're going to go before the Lord in prayer. Got many needs to pray about. I'm sure the prayer list is in the back. And then we'll bring that up here and pray, pray over it. Amen. If you've got a need that only God can meet, would you just lift your hand and look around you? And you see somebody close to you, will you just let them know and say, hey, I'm agreeing with you. I'm agreeing with you. I'm locking up my faith with your faith. And the Bible says we're in it too. Would agree. We too, we're going to agree together. Amen. And God says that he will be us there and he'll answer our prayer. Amen. You believe he was able to answer your prayer? Yes. Praise God. Let's go before the Lord in prayer today. Amen. Come, Richard, would you bring that list on up here? Some of you will. Would you just come follow Richard up as he comes? And unless it's just a point of contact. We serve a mighty God. Amen. This looks like a big list, and it is. There's a bunch of names on this list. But, uh, you know, God, we don't have a bunch of problems. But problems and needs, we got a big God. We have a big a great, big, awesome God. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Amen. He's able to do exceeding abundantly above all what we can ask or even think. He's able to meet these days. Would you stretch your hand this way? Let's pray. Praise God. Father, we thank you right now in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. We come into agreement by the word of God. We believe in you. We put our faith and our trust in you. God, there's nothing to There's nothing too hard. There's nothing too great. Brother, we just thank you that there's a name that's been given that's above every name, above every sickness, above every disease. God, we just pray right now in the name of Jesus that by your stripes we are healed. The Word of God says you sent your word and healed us. We thank you, God, for sending us the gift of your Son to bring salvation, to bring help, to bring healing to your people. God, we just thank you. We're going to give you the glory. We're going to give you the praise. In Jesus' name, praise God. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Praise the name of the Lord. 
grill the altar. This committee, we're going to ask the Elder Leeds, the ensemble, to minister the song that they plan to play today. Uh, I tried to encourage them. I said, you got two songs? They said, well, we just got one today. I said, well, let's work it over. And just did it. Play it Just keep working, okay? But I've asked them to, right after we pray over the altar here, we're going to turn them loose to minister the song. We got uh, Brother Bill was coming in this morning. I said, the brass is here today. You know, all you military guys you know if the brass comes. So that means, uh, you know, the big bosses come show up, you know. But uh, but I'm so happy to have Madonna's uh, precious young lady. And uh, I know these other young men, young men and women are, are so blessed to be with us today. We're blessed to have him with us, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Praise God. Uh, so, uh, let's pray for them that we first pray for their offering and bless the offering. You know, in the book of John, John said that it was his desire that you would prosper and be in health, yeah. and even as your soul does prosper. And that's, as your pastor, that's my prayer for you. You know, uh, I don't say a whole lot about giving. We just try to encourage people to give. But, you know, you'll be blessed. If you'll get the Word of God down and just begin to do a study about it, you'll find out that the Bible teaches that if you'll be a tither and a giver, that you'll be blessed. And you'll also find if you don't do it, you'll be cursed. And I want you to be blessed. I want you to be blessed. So that's why we encourage you each week to give and that's why we pray over the offering. We pray God will bless you, strengthen you, keep your health. Amen. Bless you financially, physically, spiritually, in every way. That's that's our desire. But uh, but there, you know, the Bible says many times, if you're willing and obedient, he'll give you the good of the land. If you're willing and obedient. So uh, I encourage you today if you uh, have slacked off on giving, check it out. Amen. And ask God to, you know, help you be obedient in it, okay? Father, we just want to wait the offering before your presence, God. We know every home, every individual, every person, God. Father, we're subject unto your principles, God, unto your word. And Father, we just ask you to touch and meet every need of every family, every individual that's in here today, God. Just let them understand. I've heard people say, well, Pastor, I just can't afford to give. But you know, my answer is, I just can't afford not to give. Because that's how God blesses us. Father, we pray your blessing. And Lord, we will give you the praise and the glory. Amen and amen. Praise God. Glory to God. Thank you. You may have said it with God bless you. I have some of you. I'm a proud brother. 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 I'm a proud brother.